Chiari by itself, a zero or a one, is not a symptom causer. Have you treated patients with CCI and Chiari type one that have not had surgery for the Chiari and seen improvement in neurologic and autonomic symptoms? Um, yes, a large percentage of our patient population would have some sort of Chiari diagnosis. More commonly, Chiari zero, maybe two thirds of our patient with Chiari zero, about one third with Chiari one. Um, Again, carry by itself generally does not cause symptoms. I'm going to say that again because it's a critical component that I think a lot of Chiari patients get confused by. Chiari by itself, a zero or a one, is not a symptom causer. So what causes symptoms in patients with Chiari is something else. So symptoms come from Chiari plus something else. In this case, the something else could be craniocervical instability, which means you treat the craniocervical instability, meaning Chiari is just a normal anatomical variant in its zero and one forms, and you don't need to do anything for it uh, if you don't have other issues that can cause symptoms with Chiari. So again, if you've got Chiari one and symptoms, the focus is treat what's causing the symptoms which if you've got CCI would be the CCI, not the Chiari.